Hello, it's Selene with Swanky Mountain and I am here today with a new review. Um, today I'm going to be talking about the Consulate Hat by Hunter Hammerson. Anyhow, this pattern was absolutely lovely. It is charted, not just with the stitch pattern, but also um, to give you the ability to use different sized weight yarns um, and to really customize it to your personal specifications. Um, so if you decide to make this pattern, I really want to encourage you to read through the whole thing so you understand all, how all of the different charts work. Um, and so that way you can make the hat that fits your head best. So here she is finished. And the other great thing about this is this is reversible. This side of the stitching looks just as incredibly beautiful as the other. Um, they have options for a short brim or a long brim. I opted for a long brim because I think the folded brim with this hat just looks amazing. Um, and it fits me so well, thanks to the tips in the pattern. Um, and I did totally follow the directions to hold it up over my head all funky like. Would look fabulous with or without a palm. Um, I just can't say enough good things about this pattern. I will say I have knit this kind of stitch previously when I made the sorrel sweater. Um, and it is a little bit of a time consuming stitch, um, but it does create this really thick and fabulous fabric. So I highly, highly recommend this pattern. For needles, I used my Addy Rockets, um, which were great, um, but I did have like the shorter tips on them, which I did not particularly love. Um, but that would be, of course, a personal preference. Um, and for the yarn, I used one strand of Manos del Uruguay's lace weight yarn and one strand of Alpaca Super Light, um, which makes this hat super warm, super squishy, and Alpaca Super Light is a mohair alternative, and so you can kind of see the fuzzy glow that it gives, which is really popular right now. And this is much softer than other mohair that I've felt. Um, so I would really encourage you, if you're looking at making something with a mohair or a mohair alternative, that you check out this Alpaca Super Light because like I said, so squishy, so fabulous. And I've like rubbed and rubbed and rubbed on this because it feels so good and it's not pilling on me and it is not felting on me. Um, so love it. So there you have it. The consulate, hopefully I'm saying that right, hat. Um, make your own, tag me. I'd love to see it. Mm -hmm.